My dad used to say, what's the expression? A day late and a dollar short. <laughs> That's always the way. It looks really good on um, you, though. Okay. Just saying. Okay, so here, we're gonna we're moving into our final. Is this our final item? Yes. Maybe. Um, at some point, I'm going to leave you. Oh, your nails look great tonight. Thank because you. Because I'm going to need to change that. for midnight. But All right. you, you have to see this ring. Pink diamonds. Don't laugh but because the Golden Globes are on Sunday and it's the first of many awards shows this season that will be celebrating probably two of the most noteworthy nominees of the last year which are Oppenheimer and Barbie. <laughs> Pink Diamonds had to play a role in the show tonight. This is two and three quarters carats of pink and white diamonds in 14 carat um, gold white gold that is just solid and gorgeous and you can just take it away at any minute because sure. it's twelve hundred dollars that you are saving off the qvc price and we have 25 of these to go around and they are right now debuting for the first time i have no doubt that we're going to sell this out in one presentation because there are collectors that have been yearning for this. I get notes all the time with your requests and one of the most frequent ones with regard to pink diamonds are we need bigger carat weights. I'm a collector. I need something significant to round up my collection. I don't want seven points or eight points. And right now, if you can find seven or eight points in a diamond, pink diamond, that's a big deal. This is a whole mitt full of pink diamonds. To find another accumulation of material that's in exactly the same color is near impossible. See, the mine that these came from supplied about 98% of the world's commodity. This is a commodity, just like pork bellies or anything else, right? And I don't know if you've ever been to the trade exchange when they, when the bell rings. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. Okay, it's yeah. like, yeah, that. I right, mean, honestly, right. the, to get invited to the diamond tenders, in particular the pink diamond tenders, is almost impossible. And it was so before that mine closed. The Argyle Mine in Australia, the most prolific diamond mine to date in the world, the one that created 98% of the world commodity, closed this year. You heard me talking about it closed earlier. because they just, they, they have nothing get left to mine. You can't get Mother Nature just to, to you know, yep, shoot it yep, up if it's yep, not there, yep. right? So <laughs> they spent a lot of money over the years going deeper and deeper deeper into pit mining and all of these things and it is now not economically, you know, it just isn't right. So they're not doing it. They're not getting it out. So it doesn't shut off like a spigot. It takes, you know, a little bit of time for the diamonds to go through the diamond bourses, those little meetings that you get invited to privately. It takes a while for them to go through the processes and be distributed wherever they're going. And so we're really seeing a pinch. In the last two years, prices already started to elevate as this was happening. They've gone up over 400%. So there are some things you buy because they're pretty and fun and you just want to have a real diamond in your collection and there are other rings like this one that, that you buy yeah. that are collector's yeah, pieces yeah. that really should be in more of a vault discovery situation honestly it's last call yeah i'm not shocked at all i mean there's five remaining again our sale price is tremendous because given what you just the story i mean i'm drooling told, a little myself we, we on wouldn't it. even it's... need to put this on sale and i'm oh. sure we could sell it out it's ridiculous um, that it's on sale to be honest so do, nobody do they, does that do they come out of the earth like pink? that like that. They come out like that. No treatment whatsoever. They don't even know exactly what it is that makes pink diamonds go pink. They think it has to do with manganese within the diamond, but they're not certain. So it's crazy. And now they're starting to try to lab grow on them, which should be really interesting. And, in you know, there's some that are coming out, but they're really inconsistent. But there's nothing like an earth mined natural pink diamond. And when they all match like this, it's it's magical. You're going to love it. I know you are. You're never going to want to give it up. But um, it's a very special piece. Yeah. I also would say, yeah. again, because I love carat weight, you know, if you are switching out or upgrading your old uh, wedding set and you, you want something that is um, low profile Truly without kind of, of like prong set and sitting up high mm -hmm. and has a ton of carat weight, which maybe your your current set doesn't. I mean, it is a ring finger dynamo. It's a gorgeous posh pink color. If you needed to size it up or down a little bit, if your size sells out, I don't have a problem mm -hmm. with that. I'm a half size, so I'd be really comfortable with that. But make sure that you check out because you don't want to miss it. Oh, one. yes. Do you know what? It just sold out. I, I haven't told you guys this despite my um producer telling me all hour thank you um we're five minutes away from the end of the show um not only will the one time only